Hello everyone and welcome back to your favorite new growing gaming YouTube channel Gaming with Jeff. My name is Jeff and we're back with Rotato on the mission of finishing all the Danger 5s. Let's just do Engineer. I'm feeling like, you know, let's just be chill. We In the last uh, episode we kind of struggled. Well, we finished our struggle with um, Arms Dealer. And... We have currently unlocked everything there is to game unlock in the game, and now it's just finishing off that last uh, achievement, and then mods, and whatnot. Anyway, engineer. Uh, if you don't know what engineer is, uh, high ten engineering to start with. Engineering mods go up. You start with the wrench. Structures spawn close to each other. That's the big deal about this character. And damage mods are reduced by fifty percent. So you're just a big old turret person. That's about it. Snake's interesting. These these are all kind of interesting, but honestly, we just want to roll for uh, wrenches. Um, we get to play the game back into some kind of like normal system now. Uh, I have to retrain my brain after the arms dealer because that was wildly different playstyle. But yeah, we're just gonna be uh, chilling inside our little turret fort talking about um, whatever comes to my mind like uh, is anyone going to see uh, Avatar 2 The Way of Water? Did you know that that movie was even out? These are the questions. Um, I don't want screwdriver I just want wrenches. Uh, I will take a pencil though. Well a lock of pencil and a lock of lumberjack shirt and the wrench and that's all, it's all pretty good. But yeah like it's it's three hours and ten minutes and you know I uh, haven't heard anything about it. Like it came out this weekend. It needs to make like two billion dollars or something to to break even or some absolutely nonsense number. And all I've heard is that oh, it's like probably like the best looking movie ever. But no one said a word about the plot, which I can only imagine is a bad sign, right? If you've seen it, post in the comments if it's you know. Good, bad, whatever. Like, I hope it's good. I just, like, have no expectations. That's a nice purple luck there really early. Oh, these are all, uh, these are all nice. Uh, let's lock those two things and just go. Yeah, we have one item. It's engineering. 31 damage turrets. Seems good. Seems, uh, nice and strong. I'm pretty sure I could do anything after beating Arms Dealer and Streamer. Like, I, I, I'm overflowing with confidence right now. And if you're watching this um, and you didn't know, the Steam Winter Stale starts in about three hours. Might pick up a game or two from that. Um, I did that poll about Dwarf Fortress and... Well, about what game I should play as my like daily game. In addition to this, as I'm trying to grow the channel. Speaking of growing the channel, if you enjoy this video, my content, or just my voice, because some people are into that for some reason. Um, don't forget to subscribe. You know, hit the notification bell. New content every day. Um, you know, it's kind of crazy. Uh, like when you hear your own voice, I think every, I think not everybody, I think most people don't like the sound of their own voice. Um, and that's like one of those weird things when you're making these videos, because like you need to go back and watch them to see like where you sound bad and what you need to fix. And honestly, like the, the first like several weeks of doing it is kind of just miserable. I'm gonna take the region. That's fine. It's like you just naturally are like, I don't I don't know what it is about us as like humans, but our own voice does not make us happy. It does not spark joy. I'll take fertilizer. Sure. I don't really care. I just want to get as many wrenches as possible. So yeah, like, 
going back and watching all my old stuff is it's important but like I still I still don't get me wrong I still do not like listening to my voice at all but I don't um like absolutely like dread doing it so I don't know random thoughts Anyway, game's looking okay. We're a little overwhelmed. I think we're a little under... A little underperforming at the moment. Uh, damage mod. Yeah, we just, we just want engineering. Enemy speed down is crazy good for us because our speed is, like, almost irrelevant. Where their speed is, uh the big factor as to whether or not they get to us. Uh, this wave kind of sucks. Forgot about this wave. Um, we don't, uh, you know. This character doesn't hunt very well. He just kind of sits in one spot. Very uh, lazy character. Very lazy. He's just efficient, though. He's, he's so strong. But things can go bad. Like, if you don't get... Like, six turrets is not enough. We need to find more turrets as this goes on. Um, I think there were... Like, this is this is suicide. Um, 8% enemy movement speed kills us. There were some changes, I think, that indirectly buffed this guy. I'm gonna do this, and this, and this, instead of having uh, the flamethrower turrets. I don't like the flamethrower turrets. Uh, uh, for example, uh, Tyler, the uh, little lightning spraying turret that's based on uh, Alexa, the YouTuber. The, uh... It's attack speed got buffed by, like, 50%. Which... You know, that, that item's totally be usable on most characters, I think. Especially if you have, like, the... The tooth that uh, slows things down. But... The, because you get so much damage with this character and his attack speed doubled, like, it just... Stuff like that's big. Strange book is also like this weird indirect buff. Because if things are going right, you take that. And then, um, you know, all elemental buffs go to engineering. And that's a much easier way to get engineering. So... These are the things I'm thinking about while I play. I'm going to take this lemonade. I'm actually going to take the dynamite too, because we are going to get um, legendary wrenches here. I don't know how many. Like, I would like to get six by wave 20. But there's no really way to guarantee that. That's just part of the random nature of Rotato. But like, assuming, uh, assumedly, like even on a bad day, we're gonna end up with like four legendary wrenches, I think. I think that's a relatively safe number, at which point explosion damage is a buff. I think, although I don't know if it's reduced by the passive, and I think it might be, which is weird. It might actually not even work with the with the turrets now that I think about it. But I guess we'll find uh, another cog is kind of nice. Um, I'm just taking more engineering. Take life steal here. It's fine. It's not exciting. It's not particularly good. 
Taking another leather vest. Um, nothing wrong with this guy being super tanky. Pencil's good. Uh, by that logic, Schmoop also makes sense. Really, um, digging for wrenches though here at this point. I'm, I'm not gonna roll now. We don't need it for wave ten, and you know, wasting that much on a reroll that. <sighs> like if you if you told me that I reroll there and I'm guaranteed a wrench, I would have taken it. But um, without that guarantee, it's like it's a really big risk. And even like rerolling and buying a wrench there, it's not that much better. But I would just assume that by the end of this wave, we're not gonna have so much money that we can't like buy a few things in the shop and then use our rerolls and keep them under the price where we were rerolling re before, if that makes sense. Um, you know, we could also die, so that's a possibility. I guess I need to maybe get some attack speed to get things off of me, some extra knockback. No. Take more max HP. That's that's a good one. Now, our speed's low. We should just take some speed. Yeah, so here we get um, we get a wrench, we get an incendiary turret. It's really strong. These are terrible shops. We get another wrench. Thanks for complaining, apparently. There's a compass, which is great for us. And we're just going to wait. So now we have two explosive turrets. So that's uh, that's a good thing. Another one of the things I don't like about this character is I don't think you're killing the elite ever. Um, and killing the elite is such a big bonus. Like getting a free legendary is kind of nuts. Um, not because like most I think about half of my runs I'll take the legendary and half I won't. I think that's you know, 40, 60, maybe 40% take it. Somewhere between 40 and 50% I'll take it. And then, like, even if you don't take it, you, you end up getting, like, 100 to 150 materials, and that's just, like, so much money. Like, it puts you so far ahead. Um, I'm just going to take... Um, we've hit a lot of, like, nice numbers. I'm going to take max HP, I think. Okay, so compass is great. Medical turret's great. Purple wrench is quite good. Indeed, we have a horde coming up. And this is fine. In theory, we are pretty good against a horde. With two explosive turrets, um, two flamethrower turrets, this medical gun, medical turret, I'm sorry, not medical gun. Medical turret's very good at keeping us alive with our other tanky stats. You certainly can play this character in a way where you just uh, try to never move. I think most characters are going to fail, like, trying to not move. I'm actually going to probably die here. Maybe. Unless we... Okay. Well. Well, that was, um... An extremely dangerous wave, but just another cog. Okay, sure. And that. Take more max HP. Landmine's great. Bunny's great. Let's just buy the whole shop. Wonderbot is pretty good here. It slows things down. There's the ugly tooth I was talking about. It just, like, synergizes well with turrets and whatnot. Uh, we won't reroll.
So yeah, really, um, what we really need is just more engineering, honestly. Um, if you're ever, like, you don't want to get chased out of your fortress like you, like I just was in that last wave. Like, it's one thing to go out and break a tree, it's another thing, like, when you have to flee. Which means my deficient, my, basically it means one of two things. My defenses aren't strong, my, my regeneration is not strong enough. Which, possible, but more, be more likely that my defenses are too low and my damage is too low. Uh, I will take, I will take that. And then I will take four engineering. And I will take plastic explosive. And a wrench and a book. Rip and tear is like almost it. This is this is all a shame. All these items are sweet, but we can't really take them. Another wrench. That's pretty good. This is an alloy. I'm actually not gonna take the alloy. I don't wanna lose the dodge. The crit doesn't matter. I don't care about the melee damage really, so just we just roll with this. Like I was saying though, we really do want to pick up some more turrets. Um, we've been pretty unlucky, I think, in that department. I feel like on an average run, you should probably have at least one more. I guess we've picked up a flame turret and a medical turret. So probably three by way 14 on this on this character specifically, not on other characters, just because he's like tagged for it. But it's like, it's okay. We we have been very fortunate in getting lots of cogs. Like, they're kind of been spawning like crazy. Ending with 440 is not so bad. There's another alloy. You know what? I, I changed my mind. At the price of free, it's a little different. Give me that, please. And this and this. And oh, yeah, that's that's what I'm talking about. Do this and do this. All right, we have another horde coming up. I would have liked to have Tyler coming into this, but we'll see. I like how my turrets like spawn later than the enemies. So we have four explosive turrets now. I did I did say four uh, legendary wrenches, did I not? We're on wave 15, so there's a decent likelihood that we get that to at least five. I'm gonna push out a little bit just to get that tree and then come back in. Yeah, I wouldn't say we've been incredibly unlucky. I just think we've been like a weird, a weird like engineering stat heavy layout rather than turret based, I guess. But it's fine. So we're about to get a uh, a nice bonus in this shop, and this level up's gonna give us a uh, nine percent dodge, which is good. We get Tyler, who's out here shooting eighty-one damage. 10 81 damage piercing bullets, which is kind of insane. Um, roll. Mm, I'm gonna roll one more time. That was uh, arguably worth it. We have 78 engineering right now. Yeah, that's fine too. We have 81 engineering right now. I would like to remain inside of my pillow fort, please. Thank you. As an adult, have you ever made a pillow fort before? I have. Um, say this. Uh, not particularly for myself, but my wife. I'm like, it's a cute thing to do.
you know, it's like reminds of this good times as a kid. You're like in your little blanket fort or whatever, reading a book or something. So like, hey, guys, if you're uh, trying to do something sweet for your lady, and she's still into that or whatever, you know. Little surprise, little surprise pillow fort. The book or something. I promise she will appreciate it. And honestly, maybe vice versa. I don't know. I is guy. Um, five armor, five engineering, five speed. We lose a little bit of region stats, but I don't think we can honestly pass an exoskeleton, right? That's all. That is a whole rocket launcher, huh? We could just take cock. We're at 92 engineering now. I wonder how this fails, fares against double boss. Like, I haven't... I've never even tried a Danger 5 engineering run. I just know from, like, lower difficulties in other characters and how engineer works that this wasn't going to be much of a problem except for potentially the last wave just because like I have less say than normal about where my attacks go but I mean you just throw enough damage on the screen it's bound to stick right at least the crab boss should take some damage because he's gonna like try and hunt me down. He's gonna like, walk through the mess. Uh, no, thank you. Um, I'll take more dodge, honestly. Landmines are great. We have an elite coming up. Let's see, wrench. Um, we can save. No reason to spend 33 rolling. We got Cookie here, so let's just dodge him and try and keep him in this area, and we should be all right. I don't particularly love this wave. It's because they're all charging. We do have 77 HP, which is kind of decent. And this boss is, uh... Well, he don't move around a lot, which is bad for him because, um... Yeah, I did not mean to pick up his thing. If you didn't know, um, I'm gonna mention, keep mentioning it. Uh, the elite drops give you their chest that has a legendary in it. it. Also gives you full HP regen, or like full restore. So it's ideal to just like leave it where it is and pick it up if you get in danger. I mean, not that we're in any sort of danger, but. That's the proper way to play. I mean, I if you're gonna twist my robot arm, I guess I have to take the uh, robot arm. And the leather vest is easy, too late for recycling. We have straight up 100, in, 100 engineering, uh, 24 armor, 44 dodge, 74 HP. This number is pretty good. Coupon? Too late for dangerous bunny. Um. One more roll. No. Okay. Why do I have a coupon on wave in the 19 shop? That's weird. I think that was just an impulse. See coupon, buy it. The only things to really worry about here are the tentacles and the armored brutes, but honestly, like... Hit it. What are they gonna do? There's a lot of AoE outgoing damage and centered around here. I've got a lot of... A lot of defensive stats. Seems like a lost cause for them. Seems like a good wave for me, though. 
692 and a treasure chest and I will take weird food. Armor. That's pretty good. It's 26 armor. It's a lot. Good wrench. Wings. Wings is pretty good defense. Where do you have 10 speed? That's not not that much better explosion size explosion size seems cool big arms not it white flag not really laser turret and a wrench uh okay see well we didn't get five legendaries but we got four and two epics which is similar so now we just gotta dodge a little bit we should be all right. It's definitely losable, for sure. Like, I'm not... My region is not good. It's basically this turret. The important part is that we have a little circle of death here. One down. We, we came close. That was a there was a couple dangerous moments there, but it is over. Engineer danger five completed. Pretty straightforward run. You jam full engineering. Get some HP, get some defenses enough to survive, and then that's it. We didn't have we didn't have HP regen, we didn't have life steal. We had we did have weird food and um well we had one weird food. We did have a medical turret. I think without the medical turret we definitely die. Um but yeah, that's engineer difficulty five, danger five, already done. Start moving back this way. Saver is one I don't love. He's been buffed since the last time I played him, but I'm not a fan. I just don't think he's fun to play. Uh, that's why I'm putting him off. But yeah, uh, we, we should be good with the rest of them. One armed, eh, it can come, it, it can, is losable too, but make it work. Anyway, if you like the video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and you know, comment down below, share it with your friends, whatever. Try and blow up the channel. I'm trying to hit. 500 subscribers before new year's not that i have any like control over that really but i just think it would be pretty cool right so yeah also discord i started discord links in the description below if you're interested if you're not that's fine too anyways hope you all have a great day i'll see you next time bye